Hey everybody, it's me, Posh here at Turtle Bunny Live. And of course, this is the first time you guys are seeing me in front of the camera. Um, it's gonna be hard to look directly into the camera just because I'm watching myself record this. So I apologize if my sight looks off, but I'm gonna be looking at the recording, unfortunately, until I get used to looking at the camera. So I hope this video is not long. I'm gonna try to keep it seven minutes and under for you guys, but at least get with good information. This video is titled below it is to cover the Hobonichi Techo setup that I did as the one book challenge and how it came out for me. My overall challenge was for 30 days using this A6 size Techo book and my donkey cover with my charm as an all inclusive planner and wallet. Now, um, with this, the whole overall goal, let me see, my overall goal, because I'm looking at my phone, I did write this out and plan it because I'm a, I'm a planner. Um, the goal was to find the best tracking and planning system for me, a balance of work and life, avoid duplication, and implement color coding system effectively. Um, I'm going to go through each of the questions and answer them because I had pretty much eight questions that I was asking myself throughout this journey. And I'm going to start with, do I need more writing space? With my journey of 30 days, I found that there's some days I did need more writing space. Where was the additional writing space coming from? Hmm, it, it could come from any additional reference book. But for me, since I started so late in the year with using a TED show, I had the months from January to uh, mid-August to use as additional notes. I was concerned because I won't have that for next year. So do I need more writing space? Yes. Not all days, but some days. I, I will and then as my businesses um, expand and um, start up I'm gonna need the additional space to track that information and I, so I know that the size of writing space is not enough for me uh, number two am I tracking everything I need to help me complete actions in my planning yes I found a way to draw out a template to be able to track all the main information and details that I need. So it's a matter if you create your own template or at least write in your pages every day what it is um, that you're wanting to track. So yes, that is very much possible. I even created a habit tracking page off the linear months and then I looked into starting an index page which I realized the index page could not work um, if I just included it in the planner versus something on the go. Um, do I need to add in a weekly planner? Hmm, no, not really. Um, it just depends on if you're a person that needs to have a weekly look as well as um, monthly and daily because the touch up for English version only comes in a monthly and daily pages. So there were some times where I looked, I was looking for the weekly pages and didn't have it because I, I don't write daily. I had I had to actually force myself to write daily um, in order to make the system work so there was a little bit more push on one side in order to get this to work effectively um, am I duplicating unnecessary information I no, not necessarily I didn't find myself duplicating unnecessary information from the monthly to daily pages where I do find the duplication process would come into play it would be for notes um, if I was on a particular day and wasn't going to have enough space and I'd have to say um, an additional little mini carrying book to say see such and such a day for additional notes that I would have to um, rewrite over or read detail out in a full-on version so yeah there's some uh, unnecessary duplication of information at that point um, is the data data easily accessible yes if you're looking to be able to get through your daily pages um, based on what you've written on your monthly so if you know there's an appointment from your monthly calendar you know what day to go reference that on your daily pages um, can you access that information should you archive it that's a different story so I'm gonna get to that in this question where I ask myself if archived how do I get important information to stay with me and do I keep a traveling like insert book in my Hobonichi cover I was trying to get us myself a solution to to any point where I needed to reference information for next year. How can I get to it without having to carry my 2014 book at the same time as carrying 2015? Because I wasn't going to need everything in the 2014 book. I'm just going to need certain pieces as it related to business aspects and some personal, but mostly business wise. So I came up with having another little mini book in the back, but I didn't really use that as a crime, but it, it would be a working solution. 
And then the last question, is the system keeping me organized and productive? Uh, yes, when you're using it effectively with any planner, if you're putting it to use, yes, the systems can work. I found myself having a weight lifted off my shoulders because I I wasn't having this, oh my gosh, I'm writing stuff down, but I'm never being able to get to accomplish it because I found like something still is broken. Um, and I'm always duplicating information. I, I Based on removing duplication out of it, uh, I'm able to, I was able to put the system to good use. Outside of the week that I was sick, I didn't get to use it for that week. But um, this book would work if you know how to put it to use for you. If you're a diary planner or an arts person, then that's a different story. But until then, I will talk to you guys later. And see you in the next video. Bye!